Welcome to this tutorial about making nested bullet points in InDesign. Here's our basic paragraph style window. So basic paragraph is just your default settings. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new style just by clicking here and double clicking inside the style. We go to bullets, 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 bullets and numbering right down here. And we want to select bullets. Now our left indent is at zero and zero. So we want to just leave it at that right now and just click OK. Now we're going to start by making a text box. And I'm going to say, uh, let's just make a list of text, like uh, list item one, item four. OK. I'm going to highlight all that text and click on basic paragraph. Or actually, click on that. We don't want our indents to look like that. So double click this style. Based on no paragraph style, and then we'll go back down to bullet numbers and we want to change this tab position to, uh, let's try a quarter of an inch. And then we want to put the left indent at 0 0.125, okay? So there's our first, let's take this tab position and let's take our left indent back to zero. And then we want our indent tab position to be as close to that as possible. So we want to make sure it's at 0 0.125. Okay, that's paragraph style one. We're just gonna rename this bullet one. Okay, next I'm going to highlight the second list three times to select the entire line. Click three times. And we're going to do another new style based on, let me double click on the new style and it says based on bullet one. Now all we have to do, do, do is go down to bullets and numbering. And then we move the indent tab position. maybe two clicks, and then we do the left indent, two clicks, and yeah, we could have it that narrow, or you could have it as wide as you want. Okay, now, done. I'll have to rename this style bullet, bullet two. Okay, all right, bullet one, bullet two, Double, triple click to get the whole line. Based on bullet one, we want that to be bullet two. We select bullet two and then do a new style. And double click on the style, go down to bullets and numbering. And we want to increase the tab position. Two clicks and then the left indent, two clicks. And there you have it. That's what you have to do to create your indented nested bullet points in InDesign.